What's up guys, this is Fan One Mark 27 here, and welcome to part 119 of Let's Play One. So, um, I think the reason why I was so far ahead was because I apparently the end zone was actually blocking the uh, 412 or something. But that 412 would have got me so quick. So if it wasn't for that end zone uh, blocking the 412, that 412 would have been on me in an instant. So yeah, thank you under Enzo for helping me in this race. And also the team you are finishing seventh. Well, the Cervera. And there's actually two team yards in the series. But the Speed 12 actually got seven. So something happened to him, I don't know what. But uh, yeah, there we go, I win. And uh, yeah, I'm trying to move on, or trying to continue through more of Class S, the Class S series. So yeah, the race, go, or well not yet, we're gonna collect our uh, winning spurts. Okay, now let's move on to the third race. Okay, so I'm going to attempt this, and hopefully I will not get dive by on the frickin' Chrysler. So yeah, let's try this again. And not get dive bombed by the stupid Chrysler. Plus it didn't help that I screwed up one of the turns at the beginning. Well, not the beginning, not the end of this trap. So that didn't help either. Didn't jump me. I don't really know how to race, except you know. Because I suck. And let's break here. I know it's too early, but I don't even care. I'm trying to be really cautious right now. I don't screw up. Man, yeah, like I was saying, on this first attempt, I'm hoping that this race will go easier than the last two races went. Right? So yeah, because it is the infield, therefore, I shouldn't do pretty well around here. Fat chance. Now watch if the other end zone's going to get swallowed up on the Chrysler and the Speed 12. <laughs> yup, there we go. Right from here because we're on the safe side. That was almost a good breaking point. Gosh, I don't know to break this turn. Oh god, look who's behind me. The person who doesn't need me behind me. Fantastic. Well, at least the other end is holding up to the speed 12, which is a good thing. However, that doesn't help with this guy. Now that I'm going about 2 miles an hour, he's still faster than me. That guy's way too fast. Ooh. So now the fun part begins. Pulling these idiots off. They may not turn well, but that's not going to mean anything. Because with, cause with the AI you can't control when they're on hard. It's, they're, they're pretty much going to be unstoppable. And 
have a for knife, a fork, they found him didn't hit me. Somehow help now. Okay, I don't know how that happened. It's not within time bombs here, thank God. Man, with the AI on hard, they're probably going to take turns super quickly. Other than a human player would do. It's pretty freaking annoying. I know I'm messing this like a thousand times in my lunch play, but I don't even care. Okay, so I don't know what happened to the 412, but now I gotta worry about the speed 12. Oh hi, that's a wall. You stay right there. You're not passing me. That's what you get for not paying attention. You're going to hit a wall. Okay, we're on the wow, we're already on the final lap, wow. Oh well, alright. Now the problem is gonna hold these guys off on the final lap, probably not. Because we don't know how good I am at failing on the final lap on every freaking race in every freaking game. Regardless of what game it is. Well, I may have a good enough lead where it won't matter, so, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Alright, well, somehow I won my second attempt, because I was actually kind of expecting to uh, do this more than two attempts, but I guess not, alright. So, there we go, I win. Well, there we go. So, yeah, I don't know how I won that race, but it pretty much all came down to luck, so, yeah. So, I won race four. So, fourth race takes us to Maple Valley. I wonder how horrible this is gonna go. I don't know, but we have five laps to find out. say something right now. Thank God I have racing cars on because if it wasn't for these racing cars I would be screwed. Because I'm actually not sliding, I'm not like not turning horribly. So yeah, the, the, the racing cars are really my one saving race right now. Oh good, looking behind me already. Good. 
when they don't need to be. Well, they pass the end zone with no issues whatsoever, which is always a nice thing. Now I gotta hold them off. Not gonna happen. No one shall pass the green end zone. No one. Except God. God can pass me because I love God. Always believe in Him. So yeah, anyways. Oh, well, so we got some canyons happening, alright. Unfortunately, that did not help my case with the freaking TVR. Because now I gotta hold this idiot off. There's always someone, I swear. Chicane's not going to help me too much because they're so fast it's not going to matter. And now I'm going to lose. Good. You know, I just want to kill myself sometimes. And going on trap, good. Always gonna do that. As they take these turns, it's really impossible for a player to do. It's really dumb. I'm not giving up. I'm going to frickin' pass you. And I hit you, good. And that pass somehow worked. Very dirty, but it's very hard to make clean passes in this game anyway. So yeah, and there you go, I'm back in the lead. Somehow... Also, I kind of really screwed up my engine in that lap, but honestly, I, I know really, I can care less. I'll try to win this race, I don't care. I would love to win this in my first attempt. I do not want to disappoint Maple Treeway from Mario Kart Wii. And Mario Kart 7. As you know, multiple games have no straps, therefore.
Yeah, that, that's the crane's not helping me, because they're way too fast. Alright, final lap. Hopefully, I'll win this. Now, since I say that, I'm not going to win this, so... Yeah, I'm going to have to restart this race. in there. There you go, I win this race. Holy crap, how did I win that? Oh, that was certainly a, uh, somehow win race. What I mean by that is, is how did I win that race? And most, and most importantly, how did I win in one attempt? Also, something else. How did the freaking Career GT keep up with the three of us? That guy is so slow compared to me the other Enzo and the two 412s. Or, well, the two 12s, but you know, they both end in 12. I I'm talking about the price of the TVR. So, yeah, more importantly, how did the frickin' Korean GT keep up with us? Seriously, how? Also, the other Enzo finished in last. How? Alright. So many questions that I cannot answer. But I am, there we go, about some slight engine and body damage in Vanille. And that's what I was going to do for this video, so... If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, and also comment down in the comment section below how you found about this video. And, uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and do the last two races in the next video. God, this one. Oh gosh, there's only four laps, but still. Anyways, uh, yeah. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please turn the live and also comment down in the comments section below here for the next video every day every day. And yeah, we'll go ahead and continue this. Now I already said this, I don't even know. Frankly, I have horrible memory. So, this has been Family with Mark Free Sandwich Google, and uh, see you guys later.